Let's rolling see. Thunder. Okay, from behind Storm Stormer. And with the Rolling Thunder, the two cores are stunned. Jiraiya stuck in the high ground. Or maybe they're stuck with him, actually. He's taking over the NA base. He's actually going to kill the Naga. This raid Watson is no longer that scary. Storm Stormer dies in the back lines. They actually find Toby as well. And these two cores, we thought they were cutting the, the team fight are now dying. Sonic Wave missed. It's actually just a celebrato celebratory Sonic Wave because Quinn knows he just took this game down. Just gonna get Coral. <laughs> Centaur chains and sides back and forth with the stolen enchant. Telekinesis. Nisha overextended. Oh, range. Nisha. Oh, that is a dead, dead black mid laner for Liquid. And the black hole being used. That's awkward. But Crit does die. The toss back. Boxy. So he oops him over to Insania, missing the LSA. He's got to juke him. What's fault? Yeah, tries to go into the pit for a second. Can't oh, the stolen that. black hole. Didn't notice that Insania had nabbed that one. Right. But Rebellion is ahead of them. With the elimination of TSG LGD, Rebellion is actually the team right now left in the tournament that has picked the most diverse pool of heroes. It seems to have been narrowing though as we get deeper into the playoffs. Do you think it was a thing of them just trying to figure things out in the group stage and now they have a clear idea of what they want? Just kind of standing around that tree line, not even hidden in the trees. Every little bit of Dota matters. Yeah. And those little things just cost you a huge objective. Shard on top of it, right? You're gonna drop it on the ground and <laughs> it gets stolen! <laughs> no way, Hophead. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad Boxy's laughing it off. I, this game's looking a lot better than game one, but again, look it up. Gotta keep it up. Matthew wants to make sure. Oh! <laughs> they rotate over the Eclipse of Fabian Edict, actually protecting him. Oh, John! Matthew gets to him in time! <laughs> oh, man. A little bit hard, but you know, you, you might say that's oh, a bit unlucky, but hey, man, they got knocked down really fast. Uh, they, they lost their first series of the upper bracket, um, which means they had to play more matches today. So just kind of an unfortunate draw, but they were so close. They were so You're not bursting anybody in this lineup. You no. have to be able to take those extended engagements. Oh, the wall, a little up. Okay. Doubly so. Missed the wall and missed the vacuum. Yeah, but Quinn did not miss his room. Him trying to hold out on top. Did use a dog pack, so the toss and the kisses landing onto Slark. Not enough to finish him off. Well, Miero is aiming for an RP. He pops the mech, heals himself, looks for it, but he misses the face shift dodge. Oh, that was glorious from Makoto. Now they turn onto Yoragi. He doesn't have Shadow Dance. Hunt throws with a blast off. Not going to land onto too many. Silence on two. They do have that imprisonment. Catching the puck and the blast landing the on mech. the Q, but he comes the mech. Q will blast them down. Big tiny combo, and the chase is on for Antares Techies. Dive under the tier one, a defense gone seriously Much wrong. Like baby Zai. The bear's angry. Oh, yeah. tree block. Oh, nice tree block. And now defusaled up out of mana. Okay, we can take away the Aegis here as the pounce does land. You have a black hole here. Lightmere's going to be able to land on the two supports. Zai keeping his distance. Where are they going to go for the black hole? They go for it now. Not really catching anything there. Oh, no. Tofu, the tombstone is going to die immediately. And reflected. Now, gets turned right back around. The LSA misses. Mickey unable to stop it. Jabs out of lead charges. He's going to die as well. Isha going up. ham. He does manage to get Tofu. Duraccio's in some trouble, but so is the Lina. Duraccio does die to Nisha. Die and Nisha. Call Lasso after the Dark Pact again by Quinn. And now Zai, his team fight started with him being targeted. It will end with him dying. Eaten alive. He could the game for as long as they could, play these sidelines and take one fight where they were able to kite the Primal Beast. Then they focused him down with the Mournless Kisses from Zai, who was positioned very well. They were able to save the draw for as long as possible. And that fight changed everything because they were able to get that good smoke afterwards where they killed the Enigma. And they did, they've made very little mistakes after that. I mean, I'm going to be honest. Nobody's listening. We're not. Because I couldn't think of anything We're to say. We're not the group stage battle. I couldn't think of anything to say after mass other the than. Mass, like the mass amount of people watching this right, wonderful right. event. The, yes, the massive love the, that's the in the air. The massive love that's in the on air. The kiss cam. Chris Log. Everybody loves so you, much. Oh, no, I can't try to What does that, that say? No. <laughs> can, you, can you at least stand up to Team Liquid? It feels like a situation that is David versus Goliath, which two years ago, leading up to the TI-10 season, you would never expect it to hear that phrase. The best spectacle I've ever seen was the taxi vultures at the, the airport. What's the, the vultures? Yeah, like the literal vultures. The actual vultures, right, yeah. Right, that was a weird one. I didn't get used to that. You know, that's one of the national animals. There's, there's tons the, of the vultures. But does Talon have what it takes to come back in this game? Because we've seen some crazy NP RTC PKBs. Oh man! On accident. Uh oh. 
and then they smoke up after. Instantly smoke after. Uh oh. And then Abed even tips them. Okay. All right. They're ready to go. Does have Blink Abyssal. Abed's canceling TP's left and right with this Nimbus. Same with Saberlight with the Aghanims here. And Crit too, as they were just going to go out again. God. Crit just goes into four heroes, and the Wrath of Nature is out. He's dropping somewhat low. Crit eventually gets a Magnetize out. He gave the gem. Okay. And that was a bit far. In a second, the stun onto the slot. Blush Rank Array connects to the portals. Oh, oh no! Tiny's disconnected. Bit of a lag. Is oh. Yuragi dead? He's it's pretty dead, right? Silence for another 0.2 seconds, I would <laughs> Because they are not your friend. This is not a 5 versus 5. This is a 5 versus 10,005 because all of the crowd here is going to be screaming for evil geniuses because it's about time. It's about time that South America, the cheers were for them instead of the North American team. But the crowd can only influence so much, Avery. Okay, the major, you lose, well, not as lucky. So you need to try and figure out a way to start off on a good foot, win game one, give yourself that extra little bit of cushion, and utilize all the reserve time. It always feels very good. So the options are down to brawling and or just complete map control. What's it gonna be? The crowd is, whew, come on. Take first pick. Yes. Here we go. That's I, it. I think they just need to take first pick in the series. I, I do believe they have choice this game, actually. At various points, he came in and he won this game for his team, for his region, for all of them. Yeah, I mean, he really did. Everyone on the team, I was just really impressed by, like, how well they read that in these moments there's so much pressure on these teams and if you get caught out like this Abed suddenly in some trouble will get slept the boat's out there too he needs to wake up but there's no waking up from that one and now he's dying in the river he has no oh, BGB oh my goodness can they get him out of harm's way goes for the LSA the stun is there and looking for more they find fly they did like a lot of good moves and it was like kind of a struggle I think when people put up like a really good fight you think about his gameplay too in every single game, he adjusts to be whatever his team needs. And he's doing that outside of the game, too. That's just the definition of a great player. And now Shopify Rebellion may have to do some evaluations on their performance, because this is this is a troubling loss. This game number two, Effie, they I see you're back into the Gaming Gladiators thing. Of course, we had to celebrate the win. But the crowd oh, is electric, what? as you can see. It is our first weekend today, and it seems like a surprisingly high number of people watch the English broadcast. They're, they're pretty oh. big fans. They're oh, pretty, they're a little too big fans. <laughs> this is highly unorthodox, but you know what, I'll allow it. I'll allow it. Oh, God. It has been an exceptional opportunity to be able to interact with uh, the South American fans for the very first time. And that's usually my, uh, that's usually the stance that I take as well. Uh, I don't think I've, uh, I don't think I'm familiar with this guy. I would, I would uh, prefer him to leave. I prefer him to security? leave. Security? Security? Okay, he's gone. Security? Right, okay. Security he's go. Out of here. They he's just, out of here. oh my God, oh they my just God. threw him <laughs> over the fence. <laughs> The he suplex. He looked great, though. Let's I like just say, watching Jabs play Dawnbreaker was like, was like having Luki Luki in the offlane. You know, <laughs> it was like watching like Mason oh. play anything not oh. Weaver. You know, this guy got to play his special specialized heroes. Jabs needs to play his Furion, Snap, and Bedrider. Okay, but wasn't that like not what a good? What do we got? Wink. Please, another trash bag. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think this is a cloak of deceit. I have no idea. I Wait, say, no, 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 <laughs> Holy shit! Incredible. That's so good. Okay, oh. this is insane, actually. The material usage, just really high levels of craftsmanship. I believe those are garbage bags. Yes. <laughs> There's a lot of tape. Dude, oh. speaking of trash bags. Is that a, like an SF? Dude, is it's that... a very clearly an SF. You just put that microphone inside that guy. <laughs> this is Shadow good. Yeah. yeah. Does he have floppy. long hands like that? Oh, yeah. That? Yeah, he's got long arms. Very good reach. Yeah. SF would be a good boxer, definitely.